Okay, hey guys, it's Shannon, Simply Shannon here, doing another video with this whole crazy setup. I apologize, I have a new camera ordered, I promise. But right now I'm filming on my iPhone, and I really did want to film this one for you guys before I dig too much into this and get using it and really form my opinion. But this is kind of a first impressions, right out of the box, haven't even swatched yet video. Okay, so this is not my review of it. This is just first impressions. I want to show you guys what I got, what it looks like, how it came to me, all that kind of stuff. And then later on, I will do a review video of it and let you guys know what I think. But I debated getting this product to myself for a very long time. I literally kept telling everybody, I ain't buying it. It's pretty, but I ain't going to buy it. I don't need that. I don't want that. No, I don't need it. And I bought it. And you guys are going to laugh at me. You're going to think I'm crazy. Let the comments start flooding in. I bought it really for one shade. I ain't going to lie. I bought it mainly for one shade because I could not find a dupe for it. And if you guys know of any dupes for this one shade, I'm going to show you. Leave them in the description bar. Because literally this is... Luckily it wasn't too expensive. But this is why I bought this. Are you guys ready to see what I bought? Are you ready? I got the Jaclyn Hill and Morphe palette. Okay. I know. Come on. I know. I know, I know there's been a lot of controversy with this. I know there's been a lot of controversy with Morphe in general. I have said some things about Morphe. Moving on. I bought the palette. So we can, there's nothing we can do about it now. I bought it. Okay. Packaging wise, this is a box it came in. It has Jacqueline's picture here on the back, her four little pictures, and it says, Creating this palette has truly been a dream come true. Morphe gave me full creative control and allowed me to customize my dream palette for everyone to enjoy. Every shade was customized by me, and I really hope you guys love it as much as I do. I wanted a range of neutrals and pops of color to accommodate all skin tones. I put my heart and soul into this palette, and I hope my pickiness pays off. XO Jacqueline. Okay, so here it is. Like I said, I already got it, so let's open it up. So this is the outer packaging, okay? Then you open it up. Oh, that's kind of pretty. Then you get this cute little post postcard. It says, Morphe and Jaclyn Hill eyeshadow now available in the stores, blah, 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 little postcard. The part I like about this is it does have this, and this is where the names of all the shadows are. They are not on the palette itself. So, you know, if you ever want the names or anything like that, you kind of got to keep the card. So, I definitely will probably keep the card with it, um, but at least it does list all the different, um, the names of all the shades. So, I thought that was kind of nice. This is what it looks like. It's just this matte thing on the back. It says Jaclyn Hill um, palette by Morphe in this beautiful silver. And then on the back here... It says Morphe times Jaclyn Hill, and it's got little JHs all over the back. I don't know if you guys can see that okay with the glare. Sorry about that. But so, and then let's open up the palette, okay? It says, oh, you guys know, anytime I open a palette, I just want to go, oh, like it's beaming up with all its goodness. So, this palette is dedicated to all my loving subscribers. It says XO Jaclyn right up there. And then here are the actual shades themselves. Now, I will link, I will insert swatches of all, I'll do row by row by row by row by row, so you guys can see them all. Okay, you guys ready? Can you guys guess which is the color that I wanted from this palette? I'm going to give you a second. Look it over. What do you think? It's that one right down there in the corner. It is called Pool Party. I wanted a turquoise -y... I don't even know how to subscribe. Okay, you know what? We're going to swatch that one. On, and I have not swatched this yet. It is brand new. Take a look at this thing. There are no swatches marks on it whatsoever. From all of the looks and the reviews and the unveiling when Jacqueline did them, I wanted that color. 
I hopefully I like it as much as it looks like I might but okay so I'm gonna swatch this two ways I'm gonna do just one swipe and one swipe here which is to me how I would swatch them and then I'm gonna do it the way Jacqueline did in her video she went one two three and then one swatch I want to see the difference and how it how it really pays off so I'm gonna swatch it the way I usually swatch stuff and then I'm gonna do it the way Jacqueline does and let's just see but I'm only gonna do it to this one shade I will do more I'll insert pictures of swatches later but you guys ready okay this is how I swatch stuff okay that's my swatch and here is oh my god I love it here is my swatch you guys that's what that's the color I wanted that's the whole reason I bought this palette okay I'm gonna clean this finger off actually I use a different finger and now I'm going to swatch it the way Jacqueline swatched it on TV or on her video. She showed us. She went one, two, three, and then swatched it down. Here we go. One, two, three. Okay. And then swatched it down. You guys, there's not much difference. They look exactly the same. I am in love with that color. That I, you guys, I am being honest you guys can think me shallow you can think me crazy you can say I, I don't know what you want to say that's the whole reason I bought this palette is for that now this palette does not cost a lot it's 30 what was it there's one two three four five one two three four five six seven. okay there's 35 shades and it was only $38 to me no brainer I was gonna buy it you can also use um, discount code so if I know Jacqueline has one or Manny anyway has one everybody has you you know any big YouTube person has um, Morphe codes you can use those on it as well so guys I love that shade I you guys find me a dupe for this I wanted this shade this is the whole reason I bought the palette find me a dupe for this shade it's called pool party it's just gorgeous and like I said you guys can see this was my swatch this is the way Jacqueline did it I think they look ex they're they're the same guys the pigment is there in this palette that's all I'm gonna say I have not played with anything else I have not touched the matte shades I have not done anything I will insert the swatches as I do them for you guys but like I said first impressions I I'm very happy I spent the money on this palette very very happy it's gorgeous you guys look how big this palette is I mean that's my head it's a big palette you guys can see it's a big palette the pans are nice good big sizes you know I've had a couple Morphe um, shadow or palettes before and I've liked them I really think I'm gonna like this like I said the colors the way they looked when Jacqueline did the swatches and with the way other people have I think I'm really gonna like this palette so like I said this is not a review I have not tried them I will let you guys know but from my initial gut feeling I think I'm gonna like it and I, I know she did say they were gonna try to restock this so hopefully I know it's limited edition don't hate me don't do it it's supposed to be coming back I don't know how I got on there to get them because with the time difference in Alaska I had to wake up very early but I got it I was very happy with it and guys that's all I wanted was this shade I know okay I know but I wanted to film this for you guys so you guys can see before I get swatching and playing with it I wanted you guys to see what I thought like I said the packaging's nice it's a little beat up here I'm not I don't know if I'll keep the box I mean yeah her pictures on it but I don't know if I'm gonna keep the box per se but um like I said and I know the controversies about Morphe and all that stuff I'm moving on I don't care I have Jacqueline's um, face palette she did with Becca and you guys know my love for that palette I love it her eyeshadow she did with Becca at the same time a lot of controversy about that mine had no problems I love it I use it all the time so like I said I bought it I wanted to share it with you guys I will do a review full review coming up but man guys find me a dupe it's right there find the dupe for me I keep looking but if you guys know of one already let me know all right guys so that is my video for this one like I said I will do a review once I played around with the shadows and I'll insert swatches here for this video for you guys to see them all but for me I think it's been worth my money I could totally eat those words as soon as I get playing with it but right now I think it was worth the money and I'm so glad I picked it up so I will see you guys in another video thanks guys bye bye